Yeah, my family's from Puerto Rico, the tropical destination, where you can spend your Washingtons, the spot where you vacation, a commonwealth with not a lot of wealth and not quite nation, $70 billion topic of conversation. Hoping to God John Oliver's comical dissertation resonates with the Congress that got us in this situation, along with suicidal tax incentive declarations. Yeah, we'll pay your bonds first, close the hospital, patients. This is an island a hundred miles across. A hurricane is coming and we're running up a loss. We got here through a million misguided loopholes that giveth and take away businesses and poop in our soup bowls. They crapped in yours, they crapped in mine. And somewhere down the line, Strom Thurmond's ghost busted a cap and a chance at chapter nine. The great debate over statehood has to wait. That's Rose and Jack on the Titanic asking, when's our next date? The ship is sinking, we have to say impatient and matters. Then we'll figure out our Facebook relationship status. Will they or won't they? It's friends as Rachel and Ross. We have to help our island just a hundred miles across. To recap. 3.5 million American civilians are on the hook for billions. Vulture funds are circling and lobbying for payout. There's nothing left to tax or cut. We're stuck. We need a way out. Allow them to restructure. There's no structure for what happens if you let this crisis play out. When May is less than a day out. It's nonpartisan. The hard part is in convincing Congress Puerto Rico matters so their heart is in the fight for relief. Not a bailout, just relief. A belief that you can pass legislation to ease our grief. Paul Ryan, I'll come sing Hamilton at your house. I'll do -si -do with Pelosi. I'll wear my Hamilton blouse. Your citizens are suffering. Stop the bleeding. Stop the loss. Help Puerto Rico. It's just a hundred miles across. Thank you.